Hey friends, Kevin here to answer a question for you, which is how much solar can you actually get on a minivan? Now, this panel is a 100 watt panel. It's pretty much the standard, and this is what I had on the van before going to something larger. And this panel worked absolutely fine unless I ran into a couple of bad days in a row when I wasn't pulling very much power and then I would start running at a deficit out of my battery pack or power station, whichever one I was using, mainly due to having to power that 12 volt fridge 24 hours a day. So going from this to a larger panel is going to make a big difference, eliminate that problem even in nasty weather. Now with that said, that gets us to the main question, how much solar can you actually get on a minivan? And keep in mind, this is a Dodge Grand Caravan, but it doesn't matter because basically all minivans are about the same size. So you're going to run into the same amount of space on here. I wanted my panel to be able to fall in between the luggage racks. I didn't want it sticking way out here to where it could hit something because I do a lot of off-roading. So it's possible that you could get larger than what I did if you were willing to have panels that stuck way out. I don't think that's a good plan. I know it's not for me because of the, where I go. So with a single panel, the largest that I was able to find that I was able to fit in here, which is this black panel you see here, was a 300 watt panel. That's the largest single panel. I could have gotten up to 350 watts if I had gone with two 175 watt panels. And I could have had them one after another right there and gotten up to that. So for 99% of people with a minivan, a 300 watt single panel, that is going to be your max. 350 watts, if you go with two of the 175 watt panels I have linked below. That is still going to give you a lot of power, a tremendous amount for a vehicle this size. And remember, most people running around only have a 100 watt panel. My much larger van that I used for several years in traveling, I had two of these 100 watt panels on it. So I now have more on this minivan than I had on that class B monster. So on sunny days, I'm gonna be able to get plenty of watts into these batteries and even on nasty, rainy, overcast, cloudy days with a panel this large, I'm still gonna be able to absorb enough to be able to run the refrigerator and not have a depletion, a big depletion in my batteries if I run into a couple of those bad weather days in a row. I need to give a quick shout out to today's sponsor, which are batteries made by Ocmo. High capacity batteries, they make these in sizes all the way up to 400 amp hours. They have a bunch of built-in protection, including what I think is the most important one, which is built-in low temperature protection. During the great days, it's going to charge fast, keep everything topped off, and that's going to allow me to use tools and microwave ovens and anything else that I want to run out of these batteries. So any questions that you have, put down in the comments below. We all learn from each other. We'll talk soon.